AFib RVR is never just AFib RVR. So let's back up a second. AFib is the most common cardiac arrhythmia that we see in patients, but I'm not talking about those chronic patients. Your 87 year old granny that came in after she tripped over the dog at home and you find her in AFib. No, I'm talking about the patients that come in that are super duper sick and they're in AFib RVR with a, a heart rate of like 140. There's always something else going on with these patients. It can be a toxicosis. It can be sepsis. These patients can uh, have a massive uh, pulmonary embolism. These patients can be having a stroke. A sep There's all kinds of things that can happen that the heart just freaks out and goes into AFib RVR. So as you know, AFib RVR is uh, atrial fibrillation, meaning that the, the atria, the top two chambers of the heart are kind of freaking out and they're like, blah, 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 blah. we don't know what to do. And the, the ventricles of the heart are like, holy cow, we got to carry things right now. We got to beat really fast. And the heart is just breaking out. So it's really important for you to figure out what's actually going on with the patient and treat that underlying pathology. And oftentimes that'll fix your dysrhythmia.